Novak Djokovic versus Roberto Batista Agut is our first semi-final of the Cincinnati Open. And the world number ones had a pretty easy run to the semi-finals, not dropping a set in his three matches. After a bye in the first round, Djokovic had to play against Ricardo Barrancas in the second round, got through that one pretty easily, 7-6, 6-4. In the third round, it was pretty much the same thing against Tennis Sandgren, 6-2, 6-4. And then in his quarterfinal against Juan Leonard Struff, it was even easier, 6-3, 6-1. So Djokovic is in fine form, and the neck injury that he sustained at the start of the week seems to have gone. Batista Agut has had a much harder run to the semi-finals. After a bye in the first round, the number eight seed had to play Richard Gasquet in the second round, beating him 7-5, 6-1. He had to come back from a set down in the third round against Karin Hashinov, eventually prevailing 4-6, 6-3, 6-2. And in the quarterfinals, he played the defending champion Medvedev, and again, he had to come back from a set down 1-6, 6-4, 6-3. Now, Batista Agut has had the tougher run of the two, but is that going to help him against Djokovic? The Batista Agut game seems to frustrate Djokovic, as it's proved in 2019. Djokovic yet to be tested in this tournament, and with RBA winning two of their last three meetings on hard court is the world number one in trouble only days out from the US Open. Can the number 12 beat the number one? Or will Djokovic just prove that he is the favorite going into the US Open by beating a guy who has troubled him in the last few matches? The keys to the match for Djokovic's point of view is he's got to keep his cool and hope that his neck holds out. If RBA is going to get the upset win, he's going to have to play consistent He's had to fight back against Djokovic in two of their last three matches, losing that first set. So he's going to have to keep his head up if he does lose that first set against the number one. I think Djokovic might lose a set here for the first time this week against a guy that seems to frustrate him, but I think he gets through in three sets and will make the final. Let me know down in the comments below who do you think is going to win and what do you think the scoreline is going to be.